Dude, it works. Dude, no way. Yep. Are you getting rid of all that? Thank you. Right on. Even this little uh, four-wheeler? Thank you, sir. Is that an EV? Yeah. Wow, a Mustang electric vehicle. Wow. Excellent. I think you're riding behind me when I was driving. Wow, what a coincidence. <laughs> All right. <laughs> wow. This is an electric vehicle, too. I've never heard of an EV Mustang. Wow. I'm kind of parked in the middle of the road here. Yeah. The garbage man gave me a text. He said, hey, I got, got something for you. I'm like, cool. So I went, I got that from his house. This is heavy. Wow. scrap right here. I should have backed up, huh? Wow. It's like springtime weather right now, even though it's the middle of winter. <laughs> Pretty wild. Most excellent my kind of scrap right here yeah we had a pretty devastating ice storm just three days ago now it's these are spring temperatures thanks again wow wonder if that electric vehicle works <laughs> Razor with the charger. Huh. Wow. Yeah. That's not getting scrapped. What, four houses down? What is this? A canopy uh, kit? Yeah, that's all metal. Bruh. Yep. Oh. Thanks for leaving it out. No Appreciate it. No, I'm, I'm good. I got the lift gate. Okay. Thank you. Even a Rufus. <laughs> yeah, he was just telling me that a, a mouse got to the tarp and tore it up. Moving on up. Yeah, this lift gate likes warmer weather, that's for sure. Yeah, this is no, not, not light. There's a lot of people out right now, walking their dogs. And... <laughs> Go -kart. That's fun. And more parts to it. Thanks again. Wow, that's turning into a good afternoon scrap. Yeah, it's, uh, I don't know, an hour and a half before sunset. Thought I'd come out and see what's on the curb. That's not a ladder. Is that a shoe rack? I think so. That's how you lock keys in the car, Paul. Yeah, it's happened a couple of times. 
is that? More scrapola. <clears throat> Wonderful. Ooh, that's <laughs> that's better than the the baking sheet that I have. Or cookie sheet or whatever you want to call it. That might not even fit in my oven. <clears throat> might as well clean out, huh? Is this illegal dumping? Not if you wave. Gotta be nice to peoples. This house had a dumpster in front of it for a while, but I think they're still cleaning it out. Yeah, so coming soon, so Coldwell Banker's listing it. But when I see a toolbox out, yeah, that's going just straight to the truck. And then I'll go back looking around. I don't even know what's in there. That's a nice roll top desk. Serious, look at, there is, it's a little wiggly, but what? I remember these little cube pictures. That's awesome. Vegetable oil. Wait a minute. <laughs> it's soybean oil. That's a misnomer. Soybeans are beans, I think. The strain, I bet that TV works, but this is scrap. I always feel uncomfortable when the garage is open. I do, I do. A little bread basket. I see a little something. This. And it's probably a paper towel holder. Yep. Yep. All right, and this. Oh, and a pen. Yeah, I'm, I, can't let a pen not get picked up. There's more stuff. Okay, we'll walk over there as well. Just don't get squished. Or is that squished? <laughs> is that the thigh master? I think it is. I think that's the Suzanne Summers special. Right, let's see if this pen works from fast technology. Maybe not. I still like it. Okay. One super quick look. Oh, their, their front door's even open. Yeah, what is this? Another toolbox? It is. What? Yep, a second toolbox. In this chair. take a look at that here in a little bit oh you know okay one more look am I flirting with disaster I might be they might say get out yeah this is all garagey stuff all right let's get going Should I? He's kind of cool. That is a cool bike. <laughs> Even though there's some bent rim issues, that's cool. What is it? A Point Beach. I don't like it. I like a lot. Hmm. 
try to go straight to the side. Yeah. And remember the rules with picking up a bike, right? Always grab the forks. So that front wheel doesn't go bashing you. Oh, that is just super cool. We good? Alright. Thank you very much. Probably should repack it, so. Uh, later. <laughs> That's a Schwinn. Point Beach Schwinn. With those cantilever brakes, or whatever they are, it's not, it's not old. It kind of has an oldness to it, old look to it, but I don't think so. Nope, and it has a helmet warning too. It's a sign of modern modernity. Check this out. I was hanging out with my buddy Shane uh, yesterday, and we drove to uh, Rockford, and just, you know, we had some stuff to do there. And it's like an hour drive there, an hour drive back. But we saw this dog, yeah. We'll talk about this during tranquility. So we saw this dog in the middle of a road, halfway from here to uh, Rockford, Oh my goodness, look how glass that is. This was frozen just two days ago. Yeah, that's a red-winged blackbird. Wow. Sorry, just had to have 20 seconds of tranquility. Oh, that is so pretty. Thanks, birds, for the for the tunes. So yeah, so I'm hanging out with my buddy Shane. We're driving to Rockford. We're halfway to Rockford, and this dog is in the middle of a 55 mile an hour road, and it's just cornfields. As far as I could see, there's like a couple of farmhouses. You could be like a like half mile, three quarter of a mile away, and so uh, we pull up, and this it was a white pit bull, and so we uh. We, I pull up and this dog was all happy and I open up the door. Now, I'm on a two-lane highway. And so the dog just jumps into the truck. Yeah. So he jumps into the truck and we're like, oh, what are we going to do now? Because we're like, you know, we're supposed to be doing something. And um, so <laughs> the dog jumps in the truck and so we're like, all right, we got to find the house. So I went and started knocking on all the the doors of the farmhouses around and they're all i don't know at, at least a half a mile apart from each other and so the third house we got to i uh, knocked on the door and no one was answering but this guy in a little bobcat from around the woods area because it's all just really big like i said farmhouses and stuff come rolling up i'm like is this your dog he's like yeah that's my dog his shock collar battery went dead or something but uh, yeah, Olivia wasn't too happy about it. Oh, that looked like some scrap. All right, we'll check that out. Actually, I'm pretty sure that that was scrap. What is that thing? It's a toaster oven. So yeah, this was the night. It was a, it was a big pit bull too, female. And the guy's like, yeah, that's my dog. He's like, let her out. <laughs> hey, those are. Hmm. I might keep these light bulbs because they're incandescent. A definite maybe. Get in my truck. I appreciate them leaving the scrap out. All right. Uh, shall I clip the cords? That actually doesn't look bad. Toaster oven. Maybe. Yeah, so it was like I said, the nicest dog. But the problem is, I'll kind of show you, there's like muddy prints. Actually, I had to wipe all this down. But so I got 
yeah a little white dog hairs all over and there's like muddy dog prints and so the truck smells of and, and the dog was wet because it was raining yesterday so the dog was wet and had mud all over her and so there's my truck smells of um of mud and dirt so i actually got some dirt in my eye so i'm driving because i got the windows down it's really nice out what is all this stuff all right let's take a, a quick look i think it's just a christmas tree any scrap nope nope all right hey there's a little bit of snow left just a little bit but it was nice meeting that dog we got off the beaten path yeah there's mud all over because i was going down these these little windy roads to get to these farmhouses to find out who owns this dog i mean and it was cold yesterday it was like 35 degrees and the dog was wet from running through fields cornfields and stuff i didn't turn the camera on but this neighbor guy in the next street over says hey i got a i have a water heater in the back of my truck i said all right i said uh, when are you gonna be over there he, and he's they're walking around uh, getting exercise because it's so nice it's another nicest day of the year huh this is galvanized steel i think <laughs> that one is here that looks like a painting the way that water is so still <laughs> pretty wild hey that's a little bit better good job snap tool I said 461. Ah, oh, there he is right there. Cool. Most excellent. Yeah, and he's out too. Cool. <laughs> he's got a segue. Thanks for flagging me down. I got it. I got the lift gate here. Okay. Yep. Shouldn't be an issue. Unless it's full of water. Oh, good. Thank you. Yeah, sometimes they get pretty full. Good. Thank you. What's a brand with a five foot bed? my second water heater for today. Oh yeah, I got those. I got those uh, toolboxes to look through as well. the other rope maybe yep I will So this is the last street that I'm going to go down and the sun just went down. I'm going to go to my shop and see what's in those two uh, toolboxes. But what a, today's been so great. I, uh, 
I went and did all my laundry at the laundromat this morning. I uh, and, and that one washing machine from a couple of videos ago, it works, um, but I'm just gonna need some help getting it down the stairs in my basement. So it, I've been kind of procrastinating. But anyway, I did all my laundry today, yay! And my blankets, and um, so it was kind of a big deal. And let me see. Oh, yeah, I'll go straight. Yeah, so yeah, this is the, actually, you can see on my map, it's the last section. This is Map My Ride, by the way. It's an Under Armour app. So, and then I went grocery shopping. Well, Renee and I went grocery shopping. Man, 300 bucks. <laughs> I'm like, what's up with grocery? It wasn't even that much. What is up with groceries lately? The price is, through, I mean, everything, to what, 10, 20% more? So, but anyway, I'm I'm not complaining. No, thank you, God. Thank you for the the provisions. Thank you for groceries. Thank you for the money to pay for groceries, God. You are amazing. Thank you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's go to my shop and see what's in those. Hey, it's a bicycle on the curb. But no, it's it's warm out. Those are kids out playing. <laughs> so yeah, let's go back to my shop. Let's see what's in those toolboxes. You haven't seen my new workbench. Yeah. A viewer told me about this humongous stainless steel workbench uh, from uh, Buffalo Wild Wings. Yeah. Uh, where's my favorite? Hmm. Mild orange. No, I like the I like the hot from Buffalo Wild Wings. All right. So what's in here? Yeah, this is a, this is a, old timers, toolbox. That is carbon choke cleaner, okay. Yeah, just looks like an old, old toolbox. What is that? There's springs in there. I don't know what that is. Little dowel. Yep, yeah, just it's a rat tail file. Yep, I like those. Okay, we'll get the other toolbox. I have no idea. I've not opened this yet. Yeah, it's pretty rusted. But this isn't rusted. Yep, just old, old toolbox of stuff. It's mainly it's a it's a junk drawer basically, a garage junk drawer. Take nails and screw that. Look, that's like a that's a lot more than a sixteen penny nail. That's impressive. All right. And one other thing I want to take off the truck and bring it into the shop is that uh, little electric uh, go-kart thing. Get it in there. There's a charger and a little seat belt. Yeah, this is the real deal. Is this the charging port? Looks like it. Huh. All right, so there's a little groove on the top. Okay. Hmm. Wait a minute. Why are you going on there? Huh. There's three prongs, but then there's a little, oh, it's on the very bottom. I see it now. I see it now. Okay, you're plugged in. Hey, my workbench is cutting into my. All right, you're plugged in. That's on. Whoa. It came on for a second. It came on up there too. Dude. All right. So is everything 
Um, yeah, it's gonna need to charge. Okay. You just said charged. <laughs> it works. Dude, no way. Yep. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about that. So I'm not sure how it's going to work out. Um, it's supposed to rain tomorrow, uh, even though there's not a, a cloud in the sky right now. So uh, let's bring this camera around here. Yeah. Uh -oh. That's not working. So yeah, so thanks for hanging out with me today. Um, this might be the end of the video, because if it's... Uh, Raining tomorrow, I'm not going to take this stuff to the scrapyard in the rain. I just, uh, I don't like going to the scrapyard in the rain and in the mud and all that stuff. Uh, so I can, I can wait. We can wait. So uh, this might be the end of the video. It might not. Thank you, God, for this day. Thank you for just everything that you do, God. Uh, thank you for having us find these things. Uh, Lord, help me find the right kid that's going to have fun with this, that's not going to get hurt. God, and Lord, uh, would you bless us, um, us that are going through issues uh, physically or emotionally or financially, Lord? Um, it's tough in 2023 going through financial changes and world changes. And um, let us focus on you, God. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Amen, amen, amen. Yeah, this might be the end of the video. It might not be. I don't know. But you know what? We don't need to get a payout to pray out. <laughs> Just saying.